Good morning, everybody. We are at the Indiana Historical Society, one of my favorite places, and Danny Gonzalez is here, and you are the... Uh, Director of Exhibits Research here. And the name of this exhibit is... Uh, you Are There, 1939, Exploring Angel Mounds. So I'm going to admit something to you. I did a book. I've been all over Indiana, all over Indiana, and I have never been to Angel Mounds. What is it, and why should I go? <laughs> well, first of all, it's totally okay, yeah. um, but hopefully you'll go and visit it. Yeah. Um, Angel Mounds is a Mississippian site, a Native American site um, that has been there since uh, about 1,000 A.D., so over 1,000 years ago that community began. Um, and it is today a... Um, a maintained site um, where folks can go and learn about these early Native American communities um, because of the wonderful work of archaeologists who have been excavating there since 1939. Wow. Well, let's walk around the corner because there are some great stories about the people who discovered it. So what happened in 1939? Danny, tell me about it. No, it's a great question. Yeah, so, like, get on this side so we can see this great picture. Right. Here we go. Yeah, so in 1939, a major excavation project began uh, led by Glenn Albert Black, who was director of archaeology for the Indiana Historical Society. And uh, with, a, with hundreds of Works Progress Administration folks, uh, these folks uh, in this program of the New Deal, um, they excavated uh, a huge portion of Angel Mounds and unearthed over 2.3, around 2.3 million artifacts. Wow, and this Several is part of the, the New Deal. Yes, absolutely. Wow, that yeah. is awesome. Yeah. All right, now there were some Hoosiers involved because they own the land, right? That's right. Yeah. yeah, we have a picture here of the Grimm family, John and Lula Grimm. Um, before them, the Angel family owned the property, and that's actually where Angel Mounds gets its name ah, from the, uh, the landowners there. Fantastic. Now, there are lots of different aspects of this. Oh, there's somebody here already looking. Hey, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. What's your name? My name's Stephanie Holman. Have you heard some of the stories? I have heard some of the Do stories. Do you like stories? Well, I happen to love stories. And prove that to me. Well, I've been a professional storyteller traveling the state of Indiana for the last 30 years telling stories of Indiana history. And you're going to be here today. Today, telling stories. And story. you're going to wait one hour and tell me about those stories. I will. Okay, we'll be back in an hour, as a matter of fact. Stay with us.